I got your flashlight. Okay, I'll go ahead and take it. That'll give you a little... We're in the top of a crazy place. I don't even know where we are in the Coleman Theater. <laughs> but it's like... Tiny. We got Elder. Peace out! <clears throat> we got Larry over here. You can't see him. Just, uh... My goodness, this place is nuts. When you get past this, this is crazy. it's going to get pretty big. Yeah? It's like going through a cave. You have that... You bet. Here's your flashlight. Alright, All right, thank you. My goodness. This place is nuts. Can't really see nothing. But it's like being underneath the house, but actually on the top. You want me to hold your flashlight? No, I'm good. Heather, tell me how much you're excited about this tornado coming. I'm way pumped. This is going to be sweet. This is what I've been praying for ever since I opened my call to Oklahoma. So. He's been praying to God for a tornado this whole time. And now we're going to drive right into it. <laughs> Shouldn't be driving with the camera on, but whatever. Here it is, look. You got to show him that stick nasty one behind us. Oh yeah? Stick nasty. You can't see it back there. It's like on the ground. It's like way over there. Tornado. <laughs> They're coming. Sick of me. That is sick over there. Oh wow. Oh wow. Man, those clouds look nasty. Oh, trees. That ungodly sound is a tornado warning. And there it is right over behind us. I think that's the tornado. Yeah, what? Yeah, is that it right there? That's what it looks like over there. So all those musty clouds. It looks like it, doesn't it? Probably not. Yep. This is so intense. There's a tornado. Tornado warning. We're gonna go get in our get in the shelter. If you can't tell right now. This is our apartment in Miami, Oklahoma. Today at 6:30 p.m. A huge, huge explosion happened down at a power station. Not too far from our home. And that candle will not stay lit. But anyways, the light went out when we were at Quiznos with Larry. And then we went to the church and heard the big boom. And so here we are trying to light this candle. Because we have no light in our house. So, we had a sweet day going over and uh, OTMing at the college because all the college students were out. It was way sweet. And so, we were able to get some good lessons out there and some people to, to teach. But now we're back here at our home where we have no power. And we don't know why, other than the, the power station exploded. So, we're going to just be bumming around, writing journals and plans. So, hopefully tomorrow will be a successful day too. So, alright, we love you. We'll talk to you later, family. Bye. Look at this possum. There was a possum. I just saw a possum. I did too. Oh my gosh. That's where the possum lives. So now we'll be able to Let's come back the, and see the, the possum. possum. Hold on. Hold on, Hunter. Hold on. All right. Look at me, Gunner. Smile. All right, there you go. I got my duffel bag packed. Oh my goodness. I got my backpack packed full of stuff just in case the tornado hits. Look at this.
coming down. Now, even if there is a tornado, we won't hear it because of the, the hail. Good thing we got eyebrows on our house. All right, so we're out in the middle of Kansas. <laughs> Another Conrad got the car stuck in a mud puddle, trying to turn around. Freak! Now we have to pull our way out. I'm glad no one's home. <laughs> My goodness. This is, wow. this is ridiculous. Hey, look, we almost made it out. <sighs> oh, I'll report back later. All right, let's see here. <clears throat> I have the mess cleaned up. All the dishes. I have the two cakes made. Yes, all the ingredients and stuff that was used, the recipe, the box of cream cheese. So hopefully we can get uh, this bad boy to stay at 350. I don't think we can. It'll be a little bit. <clears throat> this is my my first time cooking. I made some tortilla tortillas the other day, but now I'm making these called gooey butter cakes. And hopefully I'll be able to continue to have success in making them because obviously I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, it's just fun. So I'm checking out, checking out how it works. So we'll talk to you later. Bye. All right, family. This is our, it's our planning desk in the mountain home area. This is our kitchen. It's got some dirty dishes. I need to do them. I'm gonna do them before preparation day ends. And this is our bikes. This is our skimpy looking fridge. Always buy a gallon of milk every day. <laughs> nah, that's every preparation day. But this is our home. This is a, my study desk. And this is my companion at his study desk. Elder Klinger, why don't you introduce yourself? Hey, I'm Elder Klinger from Idaho Falls. I'm your son's companion. Your son's doing an awesome job. You Thanks. guys are good parents. Thank you for lifting me up. <laughs> yeah, we have an upstairs. This is our bedrooms up here. <clears throat> this is our bathroom. Missionaries have been living here for 15 years. They have a picture here in our bedroom. This is my companion's bed. This is mine. It's like 90 degrees up here. I'm sweating. But this right here is the Mountain Home Elders. For 15 years, they've been signing this thing. Let's see here. I'll show you my grandpa. <clears throat> I'll have to take it down. Let's see. Where is he? What do I mean by my grandpa is um, my uh, my trainer's trainer. They have a lingo out here for for who does what. But anyways, he's on here. My my great grandpa. He he served here in Mount Home a long time ago. This is getting baptized. Salt Lake Temple. I'm gonna take you out. Look at our, our house. We got our 05 Corolla with 50,000. I've called Elder Bowers. He's our, uh, our fleet coordinator. He's going to be getting us a new car this next month. But this is our humble abode. We're going to be looking to, to move out of here soon. And this is like the second house I've ever put a Jesus Christ picture up on the door. Which is way sweet. But they, hopefully they don't look like I got a double chin or anything. But... I'm going to send this to you, and hopefully it makes it to you this time. And if anyone um, finds this memory card and it's stolen, my name's Elder Conrad. Um, my home address is 225 Granada Court, Richland, Washington, 99354. Send it to that if you find this so my family can uh, look at some of the memories I've had on my mission and so that you can also hear a message of Jesus Christ. So you take care and have a great day. Love you, family. Bye.